Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Global Academy Institute Technology Foundation. Our topic for third quarter week one. Types of volcanoes and volcanic eruptions. A volcano is a vent that directly connects magma to the surface of the earth. It is also described as a mountain or hill, typically conical, having a crater or vent through which lava, rock fragments, hot vapor, and gas are being erupted from the earth's crust. The summit is the highest point of a volcano. The crater, which is the mouth of the volcano, is sometimes confused with a caldera. A caldera is a large depression formed when a volcano erupts and collapses. The conduit is the pipe or the channel that conveys the magma. The secondary pipes or the branch pipes originate from the conduit. Magma comes from a large underground pool of molten rocks called the magma chamber or the magma reservoir. Volcanoes are classified as active and inactive based on their behavior or historical records of eruptions. Within the last 600 years, active volcanoes have erupted and accounts of these eruptions were recorded by men within the last 10,000 years based on the analysis of material from young volcanic deposits. An an inactive volcano being dormant is sometimes called a sleeping volcano that has not erupted for a very long time but may erupt at a future time. What are the different types of a volcanoes? Composite volcanoes or stratovolcanoes are large, nearly perfect slope structures formed by alternate solidification of both lava and pyroclastic deposits form from multiple eruptions. A shield volcano is very big in size, formed by the accumulation of lava that oozes out from the volcano. Since non-viscous lava can flow freely, a broad and slightly domed structure that resembles a warrior's shield is formed. An example of this type of a volcano is Mauna Loa in Hawaii. A cinder cone volcano, also known as a scoria cone, is the simplest type of volcano. It is formed when explosive activity throws magma into the air, which cools into cinders and settles around the volcano's opening. An example of this type is Paricotin Volcano in Mexico. The Lava Baths and Sunset Crate What are the different types of volcanic eruptions? A. Phreatic or Hydrothermal It is a stream-driving eruption as the hot rocks come in contact with water. It is short-lived characterized by ash columns but may be an onset of a more enormous eruption. The Taal Volcano in Batangas has this type of eruption. B. Priatom Magmatic A violent volcanic eruption due to the contact between water and magma and can be very explosive. The water can be from groundwater, hydrothermal systems, surface runoff, a lake or the sea. As a result, a large column of very fine ash and high speed and sideway emission of pyroclastic called base surges are observed. C. Strombolian, a periodic week to violent eruption characterized by fountain lava. The explosions usually occur every few minutes at regular or irregular intervals. The bursts of lava, which can reach hundreds of meters, are caused by the bursting of large bubbles of gas, which travel upward in the magma field conduit until they reach the open air, like the Erazo volcano in Costa Rica. D. Volcanian 
This type of eruption results from the fragmentation and explosion of a lava plug in a volcanic conduit or from the eruption of a lava dome. Viscous lava that piles up over a vent. They produce tephra, ash clouds, and pyroclastic dense currents. Clouds of hot ash, gas, and rock that flow almost like fluids. An example is the Paricotin volcano in Mexico. E. Plinian. It is described as an excessively explosive and violent type of eruption where gases boiling out of gas rich magma generate massive and nearly continuous sparting blasts that cool out the magma, conduit, and rip it apart. Volcanic eruptions happen when lava and gas are discharged from a volcanic vent. The most dangerous type of volcanic eruption is referred to as a glowing avalanche. This happens when freshly erupted magma forms hot pyroclastic flows with temperatures of up to 1,200 degrees Celsius. Thank you for listening. Stay safe, everyone.